Are you trying to connect to an Azure virtual machine using the remote desktop connection? So when you, for example, when I go to Microsoft Azure and I try to connect to this device, you know, you need to download, just wait for, wait for some seconds, you need to download the, the native RODP to be able to connect to this device using the Azure remote desktop connection. So during that process, you may receive this error message, which says remote desktop can't find the computer. So this might mean, mean that on the find does not belong to the specified network. So let me show you how I fix this problem. So what I did is the following. I went actually, so just leave the device running and then go to on our help. Here you have the reset password. So click on it. So when you click on the reset password, don't reset your password. So you want to actually reset configuration only because by resetting your password, probably you forget your password, you're going to enter a new password. So I want to reset the configuration only. So the, the um, configuration, configuration only is going to actually reset your RDP process. You can see it says this uses the VM access extension to reset the built-in administrator account and also reset the remote desktop service configuration. So probably I did something wrong do with the remote desktop configuration, which actually make um, make me lose access to this device connecting remote with uh, using the RDP. So then what you need to do after updating, just click update, and this is going to actually try to reset your password for this virtual machine, and then just scroll up, go again to overview, and then click connect, go to connect again, and then here you're going to download a new rdp file so when you click download then click keep the what you want to do right now is just let's try to open this file and click connect now i should be able to log on without any issue so let's just try to log on to this device and i should be able to log on here you can see it's trying to log on to this device without any problem so this is how you fix the issue if you are trying to connect to your azure virtual machine with windows 11 or windows 10 or windows server device and you are having issue connecting to that virtual device thank you very much for your time and please don't forget to like this video and also give me a thumb up for taking my time to create such video and please subscribe to my youtube channel for more it videos bye